Hello, my name is Fabo and I'm a medical student. Hello, my name is Dixon and I'm a pastor. So I wanted to ask you how is important is mindset for a successful relationship? Thank you so much. Uh, very important question. How uh, important mindset is to a successful or a healthy relationship. Uh, first of all, we recognize or we understand that mindset simply means uh, the, the belief uh, that someone does have uh, that can uh, shape how he or she behaves. And, and that alone is a very important thing. And scientists have also uh, shared with us that, uh, that there are essentially two types of mindset, uh, the fixed mindset and uh, the growth mindset. And someone that has, for example, a fixed mindset will be that kind of a person that will say, uh, this is who I am, and take me as I am. And whereas the person that has a growth mindset will be someone that will say, okay, um, I think I can change, I think I can improve. See, all of these are very important to a successful relationship, a successful friendship, or if you even like, if you go one step uh, further, uh, a successful marriage. Uh, because um, the way we think and the way we behave uh, goes a long way to define the kind of relationship that we will have, the kind of friendship or or marriage that we will have as the kids may be. Say for example, if I, um, if I were to have uh, a friendship or relationship and I have a fixed mindset and my mindset is such that uh, I'm not willing to learn new things, I'm not willing to, to change, then it will be difficult to have uh, a successful relationship because in every relationship uh, you've got to be able to um, uh, maybe see things from people's point of view to make that relationship work. Um, sometimes you hear people say, I want friend, I want to have a relationship. The question you normally will ask such people is that, are you ready to do what friends do? You know, if you want a successful relationship, are you ready to pay the price for a successful relationship? You know, no successful relationship is an accident. You've got to, to do something to make it successful. And if you are such a person whose mindset is already fixed, that no, uh, things have to go my way or my way only, it will be difficult to have a successful uh, relationship or friendship. If you want to take it one step to the context of marriage, for example, sometimes you hear people say, well, um, I, I want a husband if they are a woman, or if they are a man, they say I want a wife. It's not enough to say I want a husband or I want a wife. If you are a woman, are you ready to do what wife do? You know, just the fact that you are old, you are 25, 26, doesn't automatically make you ready for a successful uh, relationship or marriage case to be. Every relationship or marriage does have a, a, a criteria that it will demand from you, you know, until you are able to meet that criteria or successfully, you know, subscribe to that criteria, then it will be a challenge uh, to, to enjoy it and get the benefit of it. So I will say yes, mindset plays a big, big role in having a successful relationship. It is good to have a, a growth mindset, an open mindset, so to speak, not a fixed one. You are willing to learn, you are willing to embrace new challenges, and you are, able, you are willing to do the things that will make your friendship successful, that will make your relationship successful, is a relationship, or that will make marriage successful. I leave you with this question, or I leave you with this few lines. If you are a sister, who wants to be a wife, it's not enough to say I want to be a wife or I want to get married. Are you prepared to do what wife do? If you are a brother that you say, well, it's not, it's not time for me to get married, that alone is not enough. Are you prepared to do what husband do? 
It is only when you are able to do that with the right mindset that we can have a successful relationship, friendship, or marriage case with me. I hope I have uh, answered your question. Yes, sir. I hope you have been blessed by the answer you have given. If you enjoyed it, please like, subscribe, and share it. Thank you. Thank you, everyone.